you're watching a Sony Vegas compilation. What's up guys, it's Alex and welcome to a brand new Sony Vegas tutorial. And in this video we're going to talk about leveling the sound of your videos because you want everything at a one straight line and uh, nothing too high or too low. So let's do this. So I'll be dragging my outro in. This is my outro for most of my videos. <laughs> So we're gonna split that right there, press S. I see so many people like not checking this before they're rendering a video. So I'm just gonna put this one like lower. So you're gonna have this kind of effect. So immediately like, so we're just, we're gonna fix this. You have this volume mixer at the right. Basically you want to um, level sound. So the sound is level. Everything is as loud as all the clips in your video. So we just wanna stay away from the red in this mixer. So as you can see, it's kind of green, orange. It's a perfect kind of volume for your videos. I see a lot of people like playing with this. This is going to make it sound a lot softer, so as we can see. See, that's what I'm trying to say, because I see so many videos, people are just not doing about anything. So make sure that everything is leveled. If you want to put it softer, that's okay. But make sure if you want to just drag it 100%, make sure all the clips are 100% so you get an even sound. So that's basically it. So you will just want to play around with this, uh, with the volumes and stuff. Don't touch um, the right one, the mixer, because that's perfect how it is. That's it, guys. So feel free to subscribe down below if you learned something of it. Thank you, guys. I'll see you guys in the next video. What's going on, guys? It's Alex, and welcome to a new Sony Vanks tutorial. In this video, we're going to talk about how to freeze a frame in your video like a frame and you want to have it like completely standing still this is how you do it without further ado let's jump right into it so as you can see i have my outro right here and i can play for you guys i just want to have like a frame that's like standing still so what we're going to do you want to click on the spot you want to freeze for example let's say right here then you want to press s to cut it in half and then you want to zoom in a little bit and then you want to go with your cursor on with the mouse on the line you have selected the part on the right then you want to left click then you want to click on invert remove envelope velocity and then you have this green line what you need to do is you need to find this little green dot at the beginning you want to right click set to and you want this to set to zero and as you can see the left part is still normal playing but i just freeze it on the transition to another part of the video so basically if you have frozen the frame it looked like this there you go. Your frame is just freezing and you can do this as long as you want to. Just cut it where you want to have it freeze, set the velocity to zero, and then you have your frame standing still like this. There's nothing happening. It's not lagging, it's just standing still. So that's how simple it is, guys. If you like this video, feel free to leave a thumbs up down below. It's always appreciated. If you want to see more of this Sony Vegas tutorial, every Wednesday, there will be a Sony Vegas tutorial. Feel free to subscribe as well. It's free. Thank you. I'll see you guys in the next video. What's happening guys, Alex and welcome to a new Sony Vegas tutorial. In this video, we're going to talk about how to make a slight transition between a video and another. So basically what we're going to do now is I dragged a clip of, of my previous car tutorials. Uh, the playlist for the videos is in the description down below. So basically, let's say we want to cut from here to another part. So let's say from here. So we're going to press as at the beginning. Everything within that, we're going to just delete it and we're going to just put those one together. And then you want to choose your transition. So we're going to go to slide and then we have all the options you want um, for our slides. Let's say we just have, you know, a slide in like left, right, right, left or whatever you want. So let's say we're going to pick top left corner. So we're just going to drag it exact between where we cut. So at the end of the first clip and on the beginning of the second clip. Makes sense? Drag it right there. And then we see this pop up. And basically, if I zoom in a little bit, you see this little bar, this one. This actually decides how fast it's going in your frame. So if you have it like this, it's going to get like, like really slow. If you put it like this, then it's like whoop, it's going to be in your frame in no time. So put it like this and then we'll see um, how it looks. So as you can see, it slides in from the top left corner. In the menu at the left, you can see all the transitions. So if you want to have frame two, B to cross over layer one, so A, you can see it coming from underneath. This is coming from above and all that stuff. So basically you have endless ways to have transitions. Let's pick another one. So we're just going to go back. Let's say we want to pick from the top to the bottom. They're just going to drag it right in between the two clips. And then we're going to like drag it a little bit to there. And then we can see how it looks. You can choose how fast it's going into the frame by dragging this to the right. So as you can see, you can have it like really fast like this and stuff. So it's like, it's really easy. So you can choose from the transitions at the left of the screen. That's how simple it is, guys. Um, if you like this video, feel free to leave a thumbs up down below. It's always appreciated. If you want to see more of these Sony Vegas tutorials, feel free to subscribe down below. It's, it's completely free. It's up to you. Thank you guys. And I'll see you guys in the next video.
What's happening guys, Alex and welcome to a new Sony Vegas tutorial. In this video I want to talk about color correction, you know, like how to give your videos like more power to it and you know it looks professional and better. So in this video I'm just going to tell you guys how to do it. So without further ado, let's jump right into it. As you can see I have this outro of mine in Vegas right here, better quality for you guys. Like that. What you want to do is you want to go to video effects and find color corrector. Drag it to your video track. Then you got this dialogue, you know where the magic happens. So basically if you go to presets, you can apply all uh, presets like red midtones, green midtones, remove yellow cast. You can download external plugins for your color correct. If I click on this little icon, I have a list, as you can see, full of downloaded color correction presets. So if you want to try it out and you know find like a really awesome preset, just go to Google and download free Sony Vegas color correction packs, and then you can download it and then you can apply a lot of filters on it. I'm gonna just show you how it's done. As you can see, circles are like this is where you do it with. You want to drag it to pink. It's gonna be pinkish, as you can see. If you're gonna drag it to the yellow, like a bit vintage or something, this is like mid, so you can drag it like this. You can do all kinds of stuff with this, and you know, and then you got the high. This is like really high. This is like the highest you can get. So basically, you wanna mess around with that one. Like I said, download some packs because to be honest, I'm not that satisfied with the presets that are already in Vegas because I can't do anything with it, you know? I like a really awesome color correction with like blue highlights and you know really sharp and brightness and all that shadows that's how you use color correction in Sony Vegas. If you want to see more of these videos feel free to subscribe down below for more videos always appreciate it. If you want to download some packs you can go to Google and, and you can look it up. Thank you guys and I'll see you guys in the next video. What's up guys it's Wednesday so that means a new Sony Vegas tutorial for you guys. And in this video I'm going to show you guys how to make a real simple intro so just with text and some sound effects so nothing too complicated so um yeah what I have to do let's jump right into it. Okay so let's say that we want to pop up our name in the middle of the screen so we're going to go to media generators titles and texts you want to pick this one and you want to drag it into your into your video track okay so then we have your sample text so let's say i want to have an intro like let's say i want to have my own name so we're just going to fill in just alex helper we're going to put it a little bit smaller so let's put it like this that's okay and let's say we want to have a nice font um so let's say what font we can use let's see if i can find any good fonts to use Okay, that's okay. That's a good one. So basically, what I want to do now is I want to have my own name like popping up, like it zooms into the screen. We're gonna drag it to the beginning of the video track. Then we want to go to transitions, zoom, and then you can see this transition will be our transition for like how the text comes into the frame. Click on this and we're gonna drag it exactly on the beginning of the track. We see this little bar. That means how fast it's coming into your screen. So basically, if we put it like really long, it's gonna take more time to pop up so you have this kind of effect you know but we want to have like a little more quicker so let's put it up right there and that, that looks great already but we want to have we want to spice up a little bit by adding a sound effect you want to just google some like um sounds that you can use i've already a sound open so i'm going to just drag that in here and we want to put the sound it starts at the ending of the zoom part so let's see how it sounds right now let's hear that again that makes the intro a lot cooler, you know, with the sound effects and a zoom and stuff. So basically you have endless options to do this. That's like a really simple basic tutorial for how to make an intro and stuff. So if you like the video, feel free to subscribe down below for more videos. If you like the video, feel free to leave a thumbs up down below, it's always appreciated. I will see you guys next Wednesday for a new Sony Vegas tutorial. And until then, I will see you guys soon. So that is it for the video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to smash the like button down below and also the subscribe button at the bottom. So thank you for the continued support. If you want to see more content, make sure to click right here. That's it for today. Thank you guys and I'll see you guys tomorrow.